Half a million pounds is a lot of money, Ben. Even enough to buy another beach with. Look, I've got some postcards. I've got some very fine beaches here. I want to make you an offer. How about this? Any beach that takes your fancy, anywhere in the world, I'll get for you. Look at this. Hawaii. I can get you five or six miles of Hawaii, no problem. Or look here, Australia. Look at look at that sand. Oh yes, I didn't. Well, I mean, they look like very nice beaches, Mr. McIntyre. But see, I only need the one. I have this here. I don't need another one. Besides, I'm not sure that there's a living in any of these beaches. I mean, you've got to go into that kind of thing in detail. I'll buy you any beach you want, and I'll give you seven hundred and fifty thousand pounds to set yourself up with. It'll give you some security in the early stages. Yeah. I What mean, do you say? You're great at talking with the big numbers, Mister uh, McIntyre. See, look, you're good at numbers, eh? Yeah, part of my job, yes. Right. Would you give me a pound note for every grain of sand I hold in my hand? Now you can have the beach for that. There. Eh? Saved your pound or two, eh? Come on, Ben. I don't want to play games that negotiate in a business-like way. Oh dear, oh dear. I mean, you could have had a very nice purchase there, Mr. McIntyre. I can't hold much more than ten thousand grains of sand in my hand at a time. Did you think it would be a bigger number? Took advantage of me, Ben. Did I? How about a hatful of sand? I know, no. I mean, that wouldn't be business-like. <laughs> he has this trick he does with sand, sir. So if he offers you anything to do with sand, uh, say yes, and we'll get him to sign something right away. Did you say sand? Yeah, yes, sir. Anything up to a half a bucketful. Say yes. He wants to sell me the sand. No, sir. You get the drift if he does it.